hello, 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 and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to the Wrapped and Scrubs channel. I'm glad you guys are here with me today. I'm outside in the courtyard. It's super gloomy, so I figured I'd film out here and put the light on, and hopefully it will be enough light for you guys to see everything that I'm going to show you. So I'm going to just jump right on into it. Welcome to all those who are new to the channel, those who are returning visitors or subscribers. Thank you and welcome. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. It really helps my channel. So you guys, uh, Monique Shantae has been shopping a bit. <laughs> again, again. Um, I haven't went to the Louis store yet. Not yet. But I did pick up some other things that I want to share with you guys really quick. It's going to be a quick video. I'm going to just share it and be done because I have a lot of things I need to do this weekend family stuff so let's get into it where should we start all right let's start with the purses now i love purses can't go wrong with a good purse because regardless of how big you get how small you get however you look whatever the purse is going to always still be what it is okay sometimes when you get pregnant your feet get too big you can't fit your shoes sometimes you gain too much weight or lose too much weight you can't fit your shoes your clothes but with jewelry in most cases and with purses you know, you're kind of good to go. So let's get started with the purses. Let me show you what I got. Um, I was at the coach, well, not the coach outlet, the Cabazon Mall, and I'm here in California. So we're going with the first store I stopped at was the Kate Spade store. Um, I've never purchased a bag from Kate Spade. Not because I didn't like them, I just never really went in there. But being that I've been going to the mall several times in the last couple of months, to purchase things. I kept walking by the store and I kept seeing these two purses that I really, really, really started to kind of like. So first one I got, do not know the name of you guys. I'm gonna try and see if it's on the receipt. All right, it's this one here. Let me see if the name is on here. Large Satchel, uh, static color block, multicolor. That's all it says. So there is the first one there. Hopefully it's picking up. Okay, that's Kate Spade. I really love the two-tone colors and I felt that the blue was a nice blue and that it could be worn in the fall time as well as the summer, spring, winter, spring, summer, fall. Year round, okay, this is a year round purse. I really love the shape of the purse. Take all this stuff out. I can show you the inside of it. All right, so here's the inside of it. You guys see that? Okay, I think it has a zippy on one side and then a little cubby on the other side for you to put maybe your glasses or something like that. So zippy on that side, a little cubby on that side. I love that it has the crossbody. I like that you can remove the crossbody. So that's nice. So this actually would go well with what I'm wearing today. Make sure I'm not showing all the goodies. So I could wear this with this, you know, that's cute, right? And so that is what I got. It does have little feet. They're not very, very thick as you can see, but they are there. But I really do like well, um, like solid construction bags. If you can say, I like the hard body bags for some reason. But I really like this one. Um, cross body if you choose to. I don't know how well, this is the only con I, I'm feeling about this bag. If they made a cross body on here, then they should have either made it to where the straps can lay all the way down, which you see they can't from this angle. Now, I could put them in the purse like this, okay? But if you do that, then you can't zip the purse. But they do lie down flat in there like that. So if you wanted to wear it, if you wanted to wear it like that, I guess that would be good. Let me scooch y'all back a little. So if you wanted to wear it like this, I think that would work, okay? But um, I wouldn't wear it like this. This would be like a, a little arm bag, you know, but it's nice and just in case you want to. But, so that's that. The price was originally $429. I paid a hundred and, let me see. I'm gonna get my receipt. Um, I paid $137 for it, okay? So that's that bag. That is by Kate Spade. We don't stop there. We don't stop there. All right. Again, I love the shape of the bag so much. So, so, so much, you guys. So, so much that I decided to also get it in pink. Yep. Bubble, like a bubble gum pink. Now, isn't she cute? 
You see that? Same purse, same purse, same crossbody, all that good jazz in there. It's just some bubblegum pink. Absolutely love it. This would go really cute with my outfit that I have on today. I got on some pink shoes. Oh, Y'all can't see, but pink shoes. This would go really, really well with what I have on. Really, really cute. Should I model for you? Okay, sure. Why not? Okay. So that's the pink one. This one has gold hardware. The other one has silver hardware. Okay? So that's the difference between those two. So those are the Kate Spade bags that I purchased. Moving on. Let's move on. Again, that price was $137 for that one as well. So I picked those up and then... Oh, we're still going with purses, shall we? Okay. Michael Kors. So this is the Michael Kors purse that I picked up. Okay. The price. $3.98. I paid, I think, $178. Okay. There she is. She is beautiful. And I'm about to show you why I picked her up. First of all, she's super cute. I love that. The crossbody, sorry y'all, I feel like something's biting, does come off. You can just hold it like this, right? If you want to just have a handle purse, you can just do that. But I love, first of all, I love the feet. Check out the feet. Just really nice constructed bag. Um, they had it in multiple colors. Uh, they had it in bubblegum pink, red, green. I think, I don't think I've seen it in blue, but Really, really cute. Great crossbody. Great. Perfect length for a crossbody. Right? All right. But let me, this is why I bought the bag. Let's, let's get into it. So, this is why. This is why I bought the bag. Yeah. Is that not the cutest little set? Now, I'm not really big into orange. This is like a mustard yellow though. It's not orange. Isn't that cute? And as you can see, the micro core print right here, I do have purses with that already. And I like this because it can go the, the light, the white micro core, the one I have, or that one there. Isn't that a cute pair, right? Okay, so the purse was 178, the shoes, let me see if I can remember. I think the shoes were like 120, okay, for the shoes. Really nice chunky shoes. Now these shoes are comfortable to a point, but at the top, it's a hard shell like shoe. So unless you put some type of cushion up here at the top, in about an hour, you will feel it. So just heads up, okay? This is not a, this is not no go to Disneyland shoe, okay? But, so I purchased another bag from Michael Kors. Super excited about that bag too, but let me show you what really like rocked my boat, right? Let me show you. Hi, honey. Honey just came in. My honey's home, y'all. So this is the other bag I got right here by Michael Kor. All right, here it is here. He's blowing kisses at me. All right, but let me tell you why I'm so excited about this bag. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Are you ready? I'm ready. Take all my stuff in out first. All right. And this bag was on clearance for a hundred bucks. Yep, it was on clearance for a hundred bucks. And this is the same shape as like the Speedy, like if you are familiar with the Louis Vuitton Speedy. It's the same shape. It opens all the way up. I'm trying to put the strap on so I can show you guys. Wow, so excited. You ready? Let me show you. Aha, look at that. Again, I didn't even know it until I got home. I bought it because I thought the strap was just um, a plain strap, you know, like the one I already have, the cross body strap. I have a, I have two Michael Kors purses already upstairs. I have just like a regular strap, same color as this like camel, whatever leather, right? So, to open it and see the strap inside and then be able to, again, wear my shoes with it. Your girl is very happy. So 
This one was 100. I love that it zips all the way down the sides here. As you can see, it zips all the way from side to side, okay? So that, and then it has one zippy on this side and then a little compartment here on that side. So that's that of that. Really cute, love that. That's that purse, let's move on to the next thing. So I did have to stop at the coat store because y'all already know, those of you who know, you know. What did I stop and get? Tennies to match my shoes. I mean, floor. Tennies to match my uh, purse that I already have. You guys already seen, I have this purse kind of in like the Speedy, same um, shape as the Speedy, as well as several other shapes. So I thought this would be great. I've worn them several times. I'm enjoying these shoes. So these were on sale for 90. I had to get them in the man's size because they didn't have these shoes in women. So that's 90 there for those shoes. And all right, y'all already know, I told you guys I was gonna go back and get them in the orange. Here we are. So now we have them in white, green, pink, and orange. I wish they had them in blue. I know that um, summer's pretty much over, but I don't care. I live in California. It's summer all the time, depending on how the weather decides to behave. So, got them in orange as well. Really, really cute. Okay, these were on sale for $59, I believe. All right, normally like $130, one so. So that's that. And then we move into our fragrances. Let's move into our fragrances. Okay. The first one I got, I was really at Bath & Body Works and Victoria's Secret a lot. This one, I believe, is from Victoria's Secret, yes. This one is the Very Sexy Orchid. Um, I like it. Um, Black Current, Oris Woods, Sheer. Uh, uh, yeah, I guess. It smells, I mean, it's a nice, rich, berry-ish smell to me, okay? So that's the first one I got. stop by and get some Joe Malone. This one's like almost gone. I just got the small one, but as you know, with Joe Malone, the small one, sorry, the plane's going by. We are outside. We're in the middle of my house. Um, if you check out my, my empty house tour, there's a courtyard in the middle of my house, so it's completely enclosed, but the sky is open, so if you hear a plane now, that's why. All right, so we got the Joe Malone. I got the Wild Bluebell as you can see, it is halfway gone because I have been using this. Absolutely love it. Go and check it out. They had another one that was like parsley and something else. It smelled like the death. It's like, why are they selling this? But anyhow, to each his own, to each his own. But that's what I got by Joe Malone. This one was $79, okay? Then we stopped by Montblanc. You know, they sell pens, Montblanc. I can never pronounce the freaking name correctly, but you know what I mean. Mont Blanc. Mont Blanc. Mont Blanc. Block. Mont Blanc. Anyhow, they sell really nice pens and watches, usually for men, but they also sell perfumes, okay? And so the one I got is called Lady. And this is what I'm actually wearing today. This is my scent of the day. Because when this really pretty bottle like this. And let me read to you what it is smells like Let's see if it has it on here oh my god birds are fighting and fighting okay Let's see if it says anything about what notes um anything at all no no it's a nice smell it's a nice rich berry kind of sweet just a tad bit sweet smell really been enjoying this and again this one is called lady so that's that um i can't remember how much i paid for we're gonna check i don't know what they're gonna put a real big final sale we know it's the final sale all right uh 96 dollars for this one okay so 96 dollars for the mock lock 
malt bulk pan. You know, I'm gonna show you guys have heard of the malt bulk pans. I can never pronounce it, don't get me. All right, moving on. I was at, was it Ross, JC Penney's, somewhere, I don't know. And I picked up Coach's Poppy. Okay, this one's pretty nice too. It's pretty nice little scent. I like that, um, I always start out when I'm trying a new perfume for the most part, unless I just absolutely love it. Head over here, love it. I always start off with the smaller bottles, just in case I don't utilize it as much as I think I will. I do not like wasting my money. Despite, I, mean, yeah, I like spending it, but I don't like wasting it, okay? So if it's something that I don't think I'm gonna really care for in a week or so, I'll just get a small one to try it out. All right, next one. Victoria's Secrets Bombshell Passion. Now, I know a lot of people have been using this for a while. This is my first time actually purchasing it. Um, I like it. I actually, um, I mix it a lot with Magic Spell. Is that what it's called? I'm not sure. Magic Spell from Victoria's Secret. I think it's called that. It's like a body spray and lotion set. I use it with that in, con in conjunction with that. So, we've got that one. And then we've got... I got a small little gift set size of the Valentino Voice Villa. And it came with a little small one like this too, and that's upstairs. I'll just leave that one for like my purse stuff. So I have it. I have it in the section where I keep all of my, my purse things. Okay, so that's that. And then, we got Marc Jacobs Perfect. This one is one of my favorites right now. And it's really cute. Look how cute that bottle is. Super cute. It has little cats, has a banana. I don't know what that got to do with anything. Um, a, a domino. A banana and a domino. We're just gonna leave that alone. We're gonna leave that alone. Let's continue on. Uh, a star, a bow, and a shoe and a cherry. Okay. All right, Marc Jacobs. I'm not gonna read into that. Leave it alone. It smells good though. <laughs> so that's that. Next up is Ariana, Ariana Grande Cloud. Um, this white part is super annoying, but this one has a really sweet smell as well. And I've been enjoying it. I've really been enjoying um, my fragrances. I've really been enjoying my fragrances. So Ariana Grande Cloud. If you haven't tried it, try it out. I got this one from Sephora. Oh, by the way, that Mop Block, Block, Mop Block, I can't say it, y'all. I saw after I purchased it that you can get that in, at Walmart online, the online Walmart, for like 50 to $60. So if I would have known, I would have went there. Just heads up. And then, what else did I get? Come close. Come over here with us, friends. Come close. Okay, all right. And so then, of course, I had to go to Victoria's Secret and Bath and Body Work and just pick up some, some random smell good, just some basic stuff that every woman probably has. So I got the push, the Pacholi Rose. Hope I pronounced that right. Right, Pacholi, Pacholi, Pacholi Rose, whatever. Um, pink Velvet Cupcake. These are the body sprays that I picked up in the last month. Um, the champagne toast, I also have most of these in the small travel size, warm and cozy, and I also have all their lotions as well. Let's see what else. We've got pomegranate and lotus from Victoria's Secret. Strawberry pound cake, Bath and Body Works. I've really been enjoying this one right here, Sunshine Mimosa. Okay, this one's really good too, Sunset Sherbet. This one smells like ice cream sherbet. We got those two. And then we've got Love Spill. This is the one that I said I pair with Bombshell. Really good combo. I like to put a body spray and a perfume. Okay. And then here we have Pure Seduction. And then also I had got from Victoria's Secret, um, Very Sexy Night. I got a little small one, the like the roll on, what do you call it the rolly one like this? Um, just because I wanted to try it out before, I, again, before I invest in a big bottle, I wanted to try it out and just see if I liked it. And so far so good. And then I bought a really whimsical brace, 
uh, necklace. You guys know I'm, if you don't know, I'm a pretty whimsical person. I like things that are different, unique. Um, I don't like looking like everybody else. I like to just be myself. <laughs> so I picked this one up here. You see that? I figured next, next summer, next summer or spring, it is so on. Look at that. Can you see that? Isn't that beautiful? And I got that from TJ Maxx, I believe. Oh, I also picked up a pair of Michael Kors earrings, two Michael Kors bracelets, and something else. Oh, another coach bracelet. Something like that. But anyhow, isn't that pretty? So, that is all the stuff that I picked up, you guys. Are we loving it? Are we loving our pink purse? Let me show you guys my pink purse again. Let me model for you guys my pink purse, because it's just so doggone cute. I've never bought a pink purse, you guys, never. I don't think I've ever in my life, in my 40s, years of living, 40 something years of living, bought a pink purse. Isn't that pretty? Look at my shoes, can you see my shoes? See my shoes? And we're going to buy more things. Anyhow, <laughs> anyhow, I hope you guys enjoyed the quick video. Like I said, I've got so much stuff that I gotta be, I have guests showing up in like two hours. I have so much stuff I got to do. I hope you guys are having a good day. If you haven't already, please subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. I do a lot of things, DIY, home decor, organization. I do crafts, gardening. Uh, call me Black Martha Stewart, okay? I do a little of everything, and now I'm getting into the fashion, which I've always been into, but, you know. Anyway, if you haven't checked out my mommy makeover video, check that out. Um, remember to stay wrapped in scraps, meaning we purpose, recycle, reuse all parts of your life, turn the bad into something good, whether that's furniture that you DIY, whether that's changing your mindset, getting up, learning a new skill, letting go of bad habits, etc., etc. Do something good for you, okay? Oh, so, <clears throat> so I almost forgot. I also bought a really nice coach backpack and wallet set for one of the aides that help with my daughters. Um, as you guys, some of you might know, I have two daughters that are autistic and they have aides at school. And one of the aides have been with them for about three years and she's just absolutely amazing. She's always helping them. She's always there with them to support them and to give them encouragement and to teach them. And I just absolutely love her for that, for loving my kids. So I went on ahead and spent a couple hundred and blessed her. If you're gonna bless somebody, go ahead and bless them. So I went ahead and uh, went on ahead and picked up a really nice, bag coach um backpack for her matching wallet so i just wanted to come on real quick and show you guys what i got for my daughter's teacher's aid as some of you know my my girls are in the special needs class and they do have a certain amount of aids that help them and there's one i'm not gonna say her name because she may not want her name all on youtube but she's a real sweetheart she's been working with my girls for about going on three years now and she just really really loves my girls so i picked her up this really cute coach bag here little backpack she says she likes backpacks so I picked her up this. It normally was three something, like three, three thirty-eight or something like that. I got it for one sixty-seven, and then I picked her up this really, really cute watch here. Not watch, Lord, wallet. Picked her up this cute wallet, and the wallet was how much was the wallet, Maya? I think it was seventy-nine or something like that. About seventy-nine dollars. So the wallet, of course matches bag you know we gonna she hasn't it's kind of dark it's a dark day it's a zippy in the back and then in the front there's another the very front so back there she could put maybe a laptop that would be nice excuse my greasiness i just finished running around the world here is the inside of this one here she can see plenty of space got a zippy here a couple of little pockets here nice and deep i mean it's it's a small backpack i'll put it on and show you but it's a nice, like as far as depth, pretty good. Also, there is a zippy here on the front. Aha, as you can see, okay. And then her wallet. So I hope that she likes it. I'm glad that the wallet can fit in the very front pocket. 
That way she can get to it easily. But I'm probably sure she's gonna carry it probably in the main part. But wherever she decides to do what, what she do. Okay, so that's that. And then it has a little pocket there, pocket there, and I love the back, how it's netted. Okay, let me try. Oh, and then here on the on the little, it has a little, little coach key thing here that you can hook things on, see the little hook? Okay, so this is perfect for someone who wants a backpack, but they don't want like a big, giant backpack. Um, she's a younger woman, and so I didn't want to get her anything that might age her. <laughs> we'll put it that way. Okay, so I took my daughter with me so that she could help me pick which one to get. Okay, so there it is there. There's a little... There from the back, you can also, of course, make the straps a little bit tighter if you choose. But isn't that cute? I think she's gonna love it. We'll see in a minute. She absolutely loved it. She sent me a, um, a note that's personal, so I'm not gonna read it, but just really appreciative of it. And I'll insert a clip of that. Do something good for somebody else. Remember to stay loving you because you can't love anyone else if you don't love you. Remember to stay loving God. Remember to stay loving life because you're still here. And I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.